Okay, YouTube. So, um, <laughs> practically everybody has gotten the new, um, mountain map. You just have to update your game and you have the new mountain map. Um, it's not really new for me, but a lot of players it is new. Uh, and new players may not know how to ice skate, drift, or much at all. So, I'm gonna teach you guys how to ice skate and drift slash steer where you're going uh, in the new map. So first things first, go to a private lobby. Any private lobby, just to practice by... Oh. Now that you're in a private lobby, the, there's two different places to do it. The first place to do it, actually I'll just show both uh, places to do it on the screen right now. Yeah. So, um, this is the part of the video where I'm going to teach you guys how to steer where you go. I'd recommend going down here. So, now that we're right at the long patch here. So, it's basically right down here, then there's a long patch. How are you going to do it? You're going to place your hand on the ice. And then you're going to point one finger. Just, just to get a feel of it. It doesn't really matter how many fingers you point. Then you're going to put that finger where you want to go and you'll slowly turn to there. So if I start here and I want to get over here, I can't do that. Yeah, so that's uh, pretty cool. You just uh, aim the finger where you want to go and then you will slowly turn that way. And if you want to instantly uh, start moving instead of having to get a little bit of a speed to start, you can switch between hands just like this. And you will slowly go. Also, if you do want to learn how to stop like I just did, how you can stop when you're going is you can face your hand to the side like this and slowly push your hand out. Slowly push your hand out, and it will slowly slow you down. It takes a little bit, and if you want to speed up, you can slowly pull it back. If you would like to speed up. But yeah, that's pretty much uh, the mechanics for the sliding on the actual uh, ice going downhill or uphill. So, why you were in a private lobby to get the feel of it? Because hitting off of something, no matter what will boost how far you go, uh, if you have a better speed boost. So, basically, it's pretty simple mechanic how to learn it. It just takes a little bit of time to actually follow the instructions. So, you're gonna go up to any surface that has a really, really steep drop, like this. You're going to go down, or I'm just gonna put this into perspective right here. So, you're going to go down, and you're going to steer yourself towards the corner. It will automatically put you there, but yeah. You want to just steer yourself towards the corner and slide down. Then you will hit this ramp. You you don't want to hit the first ramp, you want to hit the second ramp. Not the third ramp, because you won't be able to ice skate. Then once you go to the, you're in the corner of the second ramp. You're going to hit off of the wall, part of the second ramp, and then the ground. So make sure there's about... Um, a quarter of a second delay, hit, hit. Uh, and then, so I'll show you the difference if you hit at the same time. Here, this is what happens if you hit at the same time. You'll only go this far. But if you will hit at both, not at the same time. Uh, it's not that big of a difference, but it does help for going straight. Uh, yeah, so you're basically gonna hit. Here, I'll mark them both on screen right now where you wanna hit. So, the, um, the, you make sure you're steering down. You do not want to be with this hand. You want to do it with this hand right here. You want to uh, be steering with this hand so you can be a, have an easier hit. And yeah. So, uh, yeah, you're just going to hit with this hand against the wall and this hand against the actual ramp. It doesn't really matter where you hit, but it does help. The speed, because if you hit at the top, you do not want to hit out the top. Just like that. Just like that. And you can practice just going here. 
and practicing like that. And now, once you get this done, that's good. So, now once you get that done, what are you going to do? You are going to hit off the wall, then you'll go flying over to this wall. What you want to do, you want to point, point your hand, or put your hands over your head. Make sure when you're on the wall, never put your hand straight up like this when you're going up on the surface. Because that will pull you straight down as you just saw. It will pull you straight down. Versus if I have my hand at a slight angle instead. It won't pull me straight down. So make sure... You're going to have your hand, when you hit off, you're going to have your hand up above you, pointed. You want almost your whole hand to be on the wall, and you want to be tilting your hand, head away from the wall, and you want to have your hand at a slight angle that's going up, because that is, will tell you where you want to go. But make sure your hand's not going straight up, or else you just go straight down, versus going straight and not having a ginormous gap going down. So... Basically, to put it together, you're going to ride down from up there, get some speed, hit off of the wall. You're going to go flying, and then you're going to hold your hand here on the wall until you get to this wall. Once you're at this wall, you just don't stop holding your hand how it is. The only thing that you're going to do is tilt your fingers up, give your fingers a little bit of an incline. So, instead of having it flat on the ground, put your hand up at a tiny bit of a slant. So, um... If you put your hand up at the tiny bit of a slant here, you will actually go over the um, tube up there. But if you put it down on the slant, you'll run straight either into that or the tube. So once you put that all together, you can have a simple ice skate mechanic that you've almost mastered. There's only one more step. So if you put it together, you're just going to get some speed. Hit like that. Hold your hand still. Incline it, and there you go. Your ice skating. They did buff ice skating, so now if you get to one spot, you can hold that one spot for quite a while. It also will help if you slowly push your hand up. So if I slowly push my hand up, you can see I stay on the wall, but once you push your hand down, you'll go straight down. So, make sure you're going slowly. Also, um, there's a weird spot on here. I'm not sure where, but it is a solid spot that you can sit at. I'm not sure where it's at, but it, make sure you do not hit. Try to not hit the neon big circle. I'll mark it on the screen right now. That neon big circle up there, because you'll it will just push you down for a real weird glitch. But, yeah, once you put that all together, we're going to ice skate on this wall. The other wall is a lot different. So, uh, a lot of people will be impressed if you can do this, because not that many people know how to do it yet. Uh, but I would recommend getting a running start onto the actual slide, then doing it. Look at that, I'm just going straight up. <laughs> I made it up here. That's pretty cool. Alrighty, so now that you know briefly how to do it on that wall, what you're going to do is on the other wall now to learn how to do it the uh, going the other way. The other way is a lot different because it has different skates. Or like not really skates, but it has different um lines that are just flat. So what you're gonna do, you're going to be skating down here until you get to this corner right here where it dips down. Make sure you do not hit this or else you won't be able to do it. Once you get this corner, you're going to slap the ground. You're going to go flying over onto here. Now that you're on here, you're going to slap the ground here and then you should make it onto that wall. <sighs> that wall right there. Then you're just going to hold your hand up the same way I taught you and you should go behind the uh, ramp uh, and when you go behind the ramp you will need to jump here and then you could just slowly do that and yeah ice skate um if you get that more speed you can go but lemming 
You messed up. You made ice skating so much easier again. Same with going up the slides. You made that really easy. But honestly, don't fix it. It's a pretty cool mechanic to for people to learn, and it's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, so you can even do it from just right at this ramp. You can just get some speed and hold it there. You will uh, sometimes, you can't really fix it, but you will fly down. What that helps is to slowly move your hand like this, just so it doesn't think that you're just AFK. Well, not really AFK, because that's not true at all. Just make it, move your hand a tiny bit, so it doesn't think that you're actually ice skating. So, now that you learn all this, you can put this side all together. Fly down here. Hit here. Hit here. Hold your hand. Oh, I hit that, but you know what I mean, and you'll just go flying. And, yeah, that is pretty much it for ice skating. Um, if you would like to do this in Publix, it is not bannable. You can do it. I know for a fact it's not bannable. Just, just try not to get in a lobby full of children that think it's bannable because, yeah, you don't want to get reported over and over just for doing something that's in the game and supposed to be used. So, I'll show you guys some clips of me doing it without speed boost. Uh, oh, actually, no, I'm just not going to do clips. I'm just going to go to the lobby and show you. As you see, I practically don't have any speed boost. Gonna go here, hit, hold your hand, and there you go. They they made ice skating so easy, dude. They made ice skating so easy. Complete tutorial. Uh, if you guys don't understand, then there's not much else I can do besides, um, yeah, just watch the video over again and give you more watch hours. Cause I'm almost to 1k. Yeah. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe. But yeah, that's how to complete the tutorial. That's completely how to ice skate.